uh, good afternoon everyone my study is a uh, three year retrospective study of autopsy cases conducted at the medical college in the new district of haryana we have uh, uh, from january 20 the profile of medical legal autopsy cases is important to know that that stats in a reason due to unnatural causes and it also helps to address the demographic needs according to the mortality stats specific to the that reason this study aims to set up a profile of deaths so that we can direct regress effects to curb their incidences the finding of the study will create awareness among the people and it will also help us uh, help the law enforcement agencies to make the strategies for the prevention of such incidences the death due to natural causes in our study includes death from the road traffic accidents railway accidents mechanical asphyxia drowning accidental fire lightning electrocution mine disaster and some cases related to alcohol intoxication snake bite and food poisoning The study is a retrospective study of medical legal autopsies conducted at the Department of Forensic Medicine in Sahir Hasan Khan Mewati Government Medical College in Malar, no, in Haryana. The study includes the autopsy conducted at our institution from January 2018 to October 2020, and during the study, 386 medical legal autopsies were conducted conducted in our mortuary, and the like age sex marital status religion the months and the causes of death was compiled tabulated and analyzed in an excel sheet the results showed that the uh, males outnumber the females with a ratio of 2 is to 1 there was 255 males in the 386 oh, cases and the muslims were majority in the number there was 205 cases which is 53% of the entire uh, uh, entire cases and uh, it is followed by hindu which constitute 132 cases and there were 42 unknown cases in which the religion was not known in our study it was found that poisoning was the most common cause of death which constitute of 30% of the entire cases and it is followed by road traffic accident which constitute 27% of entire cases drowning and assault are the third and fourth most common causes of death since the mewat population uh, the, the majority of population is from the rural residents 69.18% of the cases constitute uh, were from the rural area and uh, we also uh, check for the marital status and we found that the uh, 61.15% of the population was married Coming to the uh, cause of death, the uh, this table uh, shows the cause of death. There was one one six cases of poisoning, one zero seven case of RTA, fifty cases of drowning, thirty three cases for of assault. Then there were thirty one cases which died of the natural cause of the disease. Which are followed by the poisoning cases, there were twelve cases of hanging, five cases or of strangulation, eight cases of firearm, five cases of snake bite, five cases were from uh, the uh, the death was result from from height. There was two cases of each railway 
burn and blast injury and uh, we also came across one case of negligence and one case of electrocution and the uh, cause of that was not uh, determined in six cases in month wise distribution our data showed that the majority of the cases came from june to october and the uh, november december and january the cases were minimal poisoning being the major cause of death in our study justifies the fact that the meva region is a agricultural land and pesticides are easily accessible for ingestion either accidentally or voluntarily various factors like national highway are factor unawareness and avoidance of traffic rules and the poor condition of roads makes rta the second most cause of death and the predominance of muslim in the region determines uh, that the muslims uh, the, uh, the there are majority of cases of the muslims in the data as we can conclude that and advise our uh, government pol uh, uh, agencies that various socio economic factors responsible for the high incidence of suicidal poisoning need early government policies and, and the sale of agri agrochemicals and other pesticides should be controlled through strict regulation and implementation of concerned authorities and measures should be taken to bring down the mortality rate especially in the strict implementation of traffic rules with special attention to be paid to trim, uh, drunk on driver use of mobile phones smoking while driving rash and negligent driving and educating the general public about the road safety measures thank you